The most Tony-nominated musical of the season is a play about a play, and it's already won a Pulitzer Prize. Rita Braver is on Broadway with the playwright behind A Strange Loop. How many minutes till the end of intermission? Is that how the show should open? Should there even be a show? No, it should start with what he's thinking. Which is just a cursor blinking. Because of all of the directions that the narrative could go. A Strange Loop, the Broadway musical that's drawn rave reviews. Big, black, and queer as American Broadway. And 11 Tony nominations centers on a very unlikely lead character. I am a Disney usher. I'm barely scraping by. My discontentment comes in many shapes and sizes. But I woke up this morning. I told myself to try. I the musical about a young black gay man named Usher who is working as an usher in a Broadway show and is writing a musical about a young black gay man named Usher who is working as an usher in a Broadway show and sort of cycling through his own self-hatred. Five foot four, a high school gym, sneak in a cupcake. These are my memories, these are my memories. The entire show, book, music, and lyrics, was written by 41-year-old Michael R. Jackson. No, not that Michael Jackson. This one, who grew up in a middle-class family in Detroit, spent almost two decades working on the show. Best original score. Best book of a musical, Michael R. Jackson. Doesn't get any better than that. It doesn't get any better. Anytime I look at it, I like sort of have a, a geek out moment of like unbelievable joy. Usher, 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 Usher. Usher, Usher, Usher. Jackson Usher, says Usher. the musical is in part his own story. You did work as an usher at Lion King. I worked for, uh, at Lion King, Mary Poppins, and a brief seasonal stint of Aladdin. But he says the show, which includes some provocative language and graphic content, These are my memories. is more of an emotional than an actual autobiography. And surrounded by his extremely obnoxious thoughts. Turning his own self-doubt and hopes into a cast of vexing characters that embody Usher's thoughts. Usher, surprise, how you doing? It's your daily self-loathing. One of the characters is called Daily Self-Loathing, who always sort of pops in with a smile to tell him how worthless he is, or how fat and ugly he is. We wanna know what's going on in New York. The thoughts, all played by actors who describe themselves as queer, also morph into members of Usher's family. Cause after what me and your dad went through, to send your black booty to NYU. Who, as Jackson's own family once did, struggle with his being gay and a budding playwright. You're gonna be in your new position. And the offstage saga of A Strange Loop is just as compelling as the onstage story. This is like affirming this little beat that he is having. With the team behind the show wondering if it could really succeed. From your point of view, what's different about this play than other Broadway shows? Michael has shifted the lens to a character that we never thought would lead a Broadway musical before. But Tony-nominated director Stephen Brackett, who worked with Jackson on the show for 10 years, believes the universal message has cut through. Everybody knows what it feels like to feel imperfect and to see a character so bravely and vulnerably going through that, one can't help but put their own story on top. In fact, first produced off-Broadway, the play would win the Pulitzer Prize for Drama in 2020. But then the pre-Broadway run in Washington, D.C. was delayed for more than a year because of COVID. Now, however, both Brackett and Jackson love watching the audience respond to Usher, played by Jaquel Spivey. Black boys must always obey their mothers. White girls can do anything, can they, can How old are you? I'm 23. 23, just out of college, and nominated for a Tony for Best Leading Actor in a Musical. I've had many people that are not black and that are not fat and that are not queer come to me and say, wow, Usher, huh? He's, <laughs> I can relate to a lot of stuff like that. You're like a proud father watching his right. little children get these 
accolades and these nominations. Yeah, Jack Well is the age that I was when I started working on A Strange Loop. And for Michael R. Jackson, it has been a strange loop, mining his own life for a tale of change and self-acceptance. All those black gay boys I knew who chose to go on back to the oh,